now to a news hour shares, something that caught our eye here that may be of interest to you. When you think of the most popular sports in the world, even us Americans know that soccer is number one worldwide. But what about number two? Believe it or not, it's cricket. Now, that English game is starting to catch on in the United States. Tina Martin from PBS station WGBH in Boston reports. Suiting up, <laughs> stretching out, <laughs> and getting in a little batting practice before a cricket match on a remote field in Rentham. It's an unusual game that most resembles baseball, except you have a bowler instead of a pitcher, and the ball has to bounce before you hit it. Games can last for hours, even days, and scores go into the hundreds. I'm completely into it. Natin Moeda has played since he was a boy in India. He says American co-workers were often confused about his favorite sport. That's one thing which used to happen with me maybe five, six years ago. And I would say, they would say, what did you do this weekend? I would be like, oh, I played cricket. And I would be like, cricket? What is that? Cricket was played in the United States back in colonial times, but had pretty much died out by the Civil War. Well, he's gone for it as well. But it has thrived in other parts of the world with international matches that are among the most watched global sporting events. At some games, there are even royal photo ops. Cricket in India is a religion. It's more than three times the population of the uh, United States. And there is one sport. If, can you imagine, like, uh, in states, if you have one professional sport all over the uh, year, how crazy it would be, right? It is crazy. Most of the players in Massachusetts are immigrants, representing far corners of the world. Most of us are from India, but there are a lot of uh, people from Pakistan, and other countries, Sri Lanka, and Australia. Uh, and England. Ravi Upulapate is one of the organizers of the Massachusetts State Cricket League. He says they now have several thousand players. I think there was 12 teams in Massachusetts Cricket League in probably 97. There are more than 30, 30 plus teams now. So the, the things have picked up so much. The MSCL is trying to create a new generation of players sponsoring clinics and camps. You see lacrosse these days? You know, last two, three years, nobody was playing lacrosse. Kids are loving lacrosse. So it's, it's just, the, just the matter of like how we introduce, where we introduce. A bigger challenge might be educating parents on what they're actually watching their kids play. For the PBS NewsHour, I'm Tina Martin in Rentham, Massachusetts.